Hi everybody, Bill here with uh, today's update. Today is, let me check my calendar. It is Saturday, November 18th. I want to give you an update of what's going on in the market, uh, the Bitcoin world, and what my strategy is for the next 24, 48 hours. It is Saturday evening. Uh, I'm on the California coast. And uh, so it's still pretty early on this side of the world. So uh, there's where we're at. We're at $7,800 with Bitcoin. So if you guys remember, I said that within a week or two, Bitcoin would come back up to $7,700, $7, where it was before the, before the proposed split. So if you guys were just to hold on, the, uh, the $2,000 would recover, and so it has. And so we see that it's at $7,813. Um, it's going to do – it looks like it's back to its regular pattern. So what I'm going to do is I went ahead and put um, – I guess uh, $40,000 in a sell order to as soon as it hits $7,900, 7920 exactly. When it hits 7900 bucks, I'm going to sell for Bitcoin. And then I'm going to put in a buy order for when it drops down um, $300. So, so um, I might even just do $200. It depends on what happens tonight. I'll be up for a couple hours and watch it happen. It's likely that it is going to hit that they sell order before uh, nighttime. So, uh, that's a $300 bounce that I'm expecting within the next 24 hours. So that means that if you have uh, five Bitcoin, which is probably what I'm going to do, I'm going to do five Bitcoin times $300. It's a pretty decent day's paycheck. You know, that's, that's, a, that's a good paycheck. Now, if you had 10 Bitcoin, you did it with 10 and you gain $300, that's $3,000. You could probably stop for the week and be okay with the $3,000 bounce. Um, I'll probably do that twice this week. Looks like we're back to a regular pattern. If it doesn't bounce three hundred dollars, then I'll probably just sell out of two because I'm pretty sure that I can get I can get uh, two thousand dollars a bounce. So um, two hundred dollars is what I'm what I'm minimum expecting. Three hundred dollars is what I'm hoping expecting. So I'll just keep an eye at it and uh, let you know what happens. So that's what I would do if I were you. I would do uh, sell. You know, you could sell as close to a hundred percent of your Bitcoin. As you want because it's it's looking like it's a pretty solid pattern uh, 7900 bucks if you want it to go to 8,000 if you want to wait for it to hit 8,000 then you're almost absolutely guaranteed a three to four hundred dollar bounce when it hits the eight thousand dollar mark that's usually a psychological trigger for a lot of people and they just sell off like crazy and um, it's my favorite part of this thing is it's pretty predictable that eight thousand dollar mark is a good sell-off point so it might hit eight thousand shoot up to eighty one hundred dollars for just 20, 30 minutes and then bounce. It'll, it'll go all the way back down. And that's when we're going to hit uh, $7,700. So you got a $400 or $500 bounce when that happens. So that's the update for today. Everything's back to normal. Um, I would stay away from altcoins right now. You know, um, I was messing around a little bit last few days with altcoins. It took me three days to get my money back. Uh, it's taking longer for them to do their 10% bounce than what it used to. And uh, some of them are getting a little crazy and unpredictable. So I'm recommending to stay away from them. Just go back and forth between dollars and Bitcoin because uh, that's the safe trade. So that's the update for today. I will uh, try and do another update tomorrow afternoon, let you know where we're at. And trade happy. See you later. Bye.